In this video, we're going to learn uh, how to automate trading view strategies uh, by connecting with uh, Algomojo. So what I'm going to do now here is I'm going to go and log into Algomojo, which I had already done with that. And then I'm going to go to trading view. I'm going to pull up a simple strategy. I'm going to apply it on Reliance Equity. So I'll go on to the five minute time frame. I click on indicator and I'm going to go to the technicals from there you can find a lot of uh, interesting strategies one among them is a channel breakout strategy I'm going to pull up that strategy you know a strategy is like something which has been marked with an arrow mark which can be back tested whereas indicators may not be back tested at all so it is very, uh, now by using algomojo arrow api it is very easy to automate any kind of trading strategies without writing a single piece of code so I'm going to explain how to do that so first uh, once i done with, uh, added the strategy to the charts of course i'll be able to see the strategy back tester you should be able to see the back testing results and then uh, if you go to the chart you'll be able to see the buy and sell signals so whenever the buy and sell signals are happening we're going to punch orders with the algomojo connected brokers for that what i'm going to do here is i'll go to algomojo portal from here i'm going to reach arrow api now from the arrow api i'm going to go to the api documentation from the API documentation, I'm going to go to the play smart order section and then I'm going to copy this message. So look at this message. This is the message corresponding to the play smart order. Copy it and then put it in a notepad. Copy in such a way like you're not copying with any extra spaces. Sometimes people who are copying, they might be copying extra spaces. Ensure that you copy only from the bracket to the bracket. No additional spaces or no additional white lines should be added with that. Please be careful with that. Once you copied it to the uh, notepad, then it is all about preparing the message. So the broker, strategy, exchange, symbol, action, product. So these are the values that we have to fill in. If you don't know the values, you can always go and refer in the appendix section where uh, the list of brokers, their short code for the brokers, exchanges, product type, price type and uh, all the combinations has been already provided over here. You can easily refer to the appendix and you can build your own uh, message. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to place orders in Reliance. So I'm going to go and type Reliance-EQ. So this symbol, if you are not sure, you can go and refer from the Algomojo portal itself. Go back and check for Reliance. It's a Reliance-EQ is what some broker they use. Some brokers, they might use a different format. So check the format and then apply the same format over here. I'm going to uh, action. So what we're going to do here is instead of action, we're going to have a ready-made action over here. Uh, in If I create an alert over here, if I go and create an alert, right, you can find uh, uh, placeholders in this section. So you can place the action over here. This is a placeholder for action. Automatically, trading view will fill the buy and sell value based upon which signal is happening. So instead of buy, I'm going to replace with an action over here. Product, I'm going to make it like MAS. MAS is more intraday order. NRML is carry forward for FNO derivative and CNC is for equity markets delivery. Price type, I'm going to make it like uh, market itself. And quantity, I'm going to keep it as the quantity itself. So let's say I want to trade, my actual quantity I want to trade is like, uh, I want to trade some 100 shares of Reliance with the broker angel broking. So N is the short code for angel broking. I'll give a trading strategy name. I'll say like a trading view strategy, trading view strategy. And uh, exchange is going to be NSC symbol is Reliance. Action is strategy dot order dot action. Product is MAS. Price type is market. And quantity is going to be 100. Price is going to be zero because we're going to punch market order. Position size. So this is what the most important point come over here. So there is a position size variable is here. I'm going to copy the position size and I'm going to assign it over here. Okay. And then I'm going to apply the trigger price, disclose quantity, AMO, uh, rest everything. I'm going to keep it as normal itself. If in case, if you want to execute larger order, you can use split and you can set the split size so that if the quantity is very big, you can slice it into multiple orders. Algomojo automatically slices into multiple orders. Now, the thing what I have to do is very simple. Copy it. Again, ensure that you're not copying any white spaces or any extra spaces. Paste it over here. Uh, give an alert name. Alert name, I'm going to say like angel broking uh, trade automation. So you can give any name. Mostly it is for our reference. And then from the notification section, I have to enter the webhook URL. The webhook URL is nothing but the 
place smart order endpoint url itself if you click on place smart order you'll be getting that uh, url just simply copy the url and then bring it into the webhook url section of course you need to have an uh, pro account in trading view if in case if you want to use the webhook url feature so every time there is a buy sell signals are happening intelligently algomojo will detect and then accordingly apply the position size now there is one more thing need to be done before uh, setting up the message let me go back and then uh, before setting up the message before creating the alert one have to go to the settings go to the properties set what is the trading size you're going to play with let's say 100 is the quantity i'm going to punch the 100 quantity over here i'll press ok and then uh, you create the alert you should be able to see that the actual quantity which is going to get punched right and then now go back and add an alert enter the message and set the alert name angel automation and then now create the alert now rest everything algo mojo will take care of it in a very intelligent fashion i hope that explains how to create an alert how to use play smart order feature to transmit automated orders in a very smart manner of course all the orders will be uh, before sending the order it checks the position book and accordingly it intelligently manages the position maybe in a separate video we'll talk about how the play smarter functionality works uh, but this is more than enough to do a simple automation without any single uh, without writing any single piece of code so see you in the next video with more interesting context thank you